Hey interwebs, welcome back, it's Tethys, and this is the Resident Evil HD Remaster. So, right now we have gotten into one of the storerooms, which is exactly where we want to be right now. Because that means that I can pick up all of the little nice things in here, like the flashbang! And then we're going to store some of our items here. Da 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 Hmm. Are we going to need this crank? I don't think we are. Uh, let's hold on to it for the moment. We will get rid of the blue and red herbs and the ink ribbon, because we don't need to hold on to that. And let's grab our handgun and the magazine. And, oh, still plenty of kerosene. Don't know if I necessarily want to do that. Okay, we've got all the items in here. So, let's venture back out. I also apologize if it looks a little, it's probably going to drive some of you OCD people a little, uh, a little crazy. Um, but yeah, Scarlet Witch decided she was going to fall off the wall and become crooked in her frame. And I don't want to necessarily try and take her out because she can be a bit of a pain to pull out just based on how she is inside the frame. <sighs> oh shit, what the fuck? What is that? Jesus. Oh my god, that scared the shit out of me. Uh, okay then. Okay, that's locked. Reads 001. This looks like it's pushed. Ah, ha, 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 ha. Wait. I th think I know what I want to do with this. I'm going to push it where that other crate is. And hopefully that means we can block the hole. I'm just guessing here. Come on, Chris. Use those muscly muscles. Wait. <gasps> I'm so dead! Or not. Doesn't matter, though, because that thing's gonna get me! Oh my god. Okay, let's just can I go out this door. Yes, and it's one I haven't gone through yet. So let's see what's in here. Oh my god! Oh. Oh, a green herb, though. Did that... Did that th Oh my god, there's another. Okay, so... We're gonna go and quickly heal here. No, 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 no. Do not want to go there, Chris. No, we don't. Alright. Well, save this right here for a reason, I guess. Alright, let's just get rid of that. No, that's not what I wanted to do, dang it. But no point in holding onto the shotgun anymore. And put that there. And then put that there. Let's make us some drugs. And then we're gonna snort these real hard. Oi. And now... Oh, I didn't realize we had that many ink ribbons. No. There. Oh, wait. No, don't I want to go... 
Sweet. Okay, there we go. Now they're combined. And let's grab the canteen. And fill her up. Okay, so we've got four uses, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Alright. Now, hopefully... That spider stays dead, because it looked pretty dead. But I'd rather him stay that way. Okay. Off we go. Uh, yeah, 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 I want to go through that room, but Mr. Tentacle is here. Uh, let's see if we can make it. Run for it! No, Chris! You can't make a run for it. You're so slow. Let me go. Oh, thank God it's open, though, or else that would have really freaking sucked. Ooh! What's this? Nothing useful. There is an open window in a long hallway. I already don't trust this. Actually, can I close that window, please? No? Oh, something's totally gonna jump through. I just know it. Or not? Newspapers! They all seem to contain articles about stars. Oh, that's not suspicious at all, no. Oh! There's a map? The door plate reads gallery. What's this? No, nope, nothing. Okay. Pretty sure that's a map on the wall, though, which would be infinitely more useful than anything else. A map of the residence. Take it. Yeah, I'll take it. Okay, so we've got this area where the spiders are. This door is blocked. Apparently there's something in this hallway that we're missing. Wondering if it's under that crate, although I don't want to... There's a hole in the wall. I see a giant beehive. Oh, crap! Bees everywhere! Bees! Nope. Not doing it. Nope. 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 I don't... No. No. I don't trust anything. Wait. Oh, okay, shit, it is there. Can you not, please? Thank you. I, I know you think this is a hentai, but it's not. Okay, now let's see if there was anything under this box. I sincerely doubt it. Oh! I'm dumb! Okay, well, that's great, Tethys. That's just fucking brilliant. You really put on your thinking cap. Okay, Mr. Spidey Spoo didn't come back down. There's lots of stuff in there. And I'm pretty sure it's blocked. This partition is decorated with dishes. I wouldn't necessarily say... De really? 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 I guess this is a bar, so I can't really be that surprised. But really? What's this? Why is there blood on the floor? Ooh, green herb. Oh my god, sparkly. A red oil lamp. It's not lit. Can we light it? Yes, we can! A strange silhouette. Oh, it's an eyeball. Could it have some kind of meaning? Uh, I'm pretty sure it's not just there for nothing, although I'm curious as to what it's there for. And it doesn't look like there's anything on the wall, aside from that giant-ass spider. Mr. Spider, you just stay there, and we'll be friends, okay? Otherwise, I'll have to do things and kill you. What's this? Bandage with blood. Well, that's just lovely. Uh, let's just use this green herb, because we need to, and it clears up space. 
Uh, those are sh- I heard you! Oh, there's another oil lamp. Let's light that up. What does it give me this time? Another eye. Green light. Could it have some kind of meaning? Probably around the same meaning as the other one, Chris. Boop, 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 ba -doop, ba -doop. I don't think 15 bullets is gonna be enough. Okay, it's on that wall. It's not coming over here, I don't think. Oh my god, so wait, some billiard balls. Two, three, four, five, six. There doesn't seem to be anything significant about the order, but... I'm... yeah, okay, you just put a but. I'm pretty sure that it means something. You're not getting to me, mister. I don't care how flexible you are. Oh. Red, green, and orange. Red, green. That's kind of orange. Okay, well, me lighting them didn't really do anything. So... I don't think I can really do too much else in here right now, aside from grab that other stuff. Unless I'm missing something, in which case, please let me know if I don't catch, if I don't figure it out this, this playthrough. Okay. Let's get the book, because that seems more important than anything else. So what's inside? It's a book with a red cover. No shit, Sherlock. Is there... Like, oh, there we go. Nothing's printed. Is there a special way to use it? Bandage with... Okay. Maybe... If we use it near the lamps? Nope. Okay, so we've got a med kit here, I think. Yeah, okay, so it's a med kit, some shotgun shells. We'll leave those for later, because we've got a decent amount of ammo right now. The spider is hanging up there. Um... No, I don't want to look in there. Okay, so yeah, there's no other entrance or exit here, so we're going to have to go out into the hallway again. Uh, I wonder. Locked door plate reads 001. No, Chris, stop it. There's gotta be something in here I'm not... Oh! <laughs> Alright, so we've got two blue herbs, probably because the spiders are toxic. Based on all that green stuff that came out of the one I killed. Good to know they only take three shotgun shots to kill, though. We do have to go back through that, uh, the hallway of bees. Dang it, Chris. Ha-ha! Can't stop me now. Come on. There you go. Alright, gonna get in here and then open up the map and make a mad dash. Uh, okay, this one's locked, so we have that one door at the end. Bees! Bees! They're angry as hell! Okay, okay. Oh! Is this the infirmary? Soaked in blood. Bandage with blood. Okay. Oh! What's this, notes? 
Plant 42 report. I think that's the thing that we killed. Four days have passed since the accident. The plant at point 42 is growing at an amazing rate. Although there are many unknown aspects about this plant, we know that in comparison with the other group of plants, the T-virus has had a substantially stronger effect on this one. The T-virus has drastically morphed its host's anatomy as well as its size. Looking at its current state, it's difficult to imagine its original appearance. Nowhere on Earth will you find anything like it. We've also found that Plant 42 has two main sources of acquiring its necessary nutrients. One source is through its root. Somehow it's rooted itself down into the basement. Immediately after the accident, a scientist went mad and destroyed the Aqua Ring. Ever since, the basement has been like a pool. There's a high possibility it's one of the chemicals in the water that's promoting the Plant 42's rapid growth. However, we have yet to determine the specific chemical. A bulb-like body of the Plant 42 has been sighted hanging from the ceiling on the first floor, where we are sure it used the air ducts to reach the first floor. Numerous long, tentacle-like vines are protruding from the bulb. We believe the vines are the second means of acquiring its nutrients. When the Plant 42 senses its prey, it uses the tentacle-like vines to capture its prey. After doing so, it sucks suckers on the vine drain the play, play, prey of its blood. We've also noticed that it has some intelligence. When it captures its prey, or when it's inactive, the vines twine around the door to stop possible intruders. Unfortunately, several of our scientists have already fallen victim to the Plant 42. When we heard the stories from the survivors, they all observed one thing in common. When the uniform petal-like flaps open and reveal its in vital internals, it has a tendency to become more aggressive. One witness reported that it was as if it was trying to protect itself. Why it behaves the way it does is still unknown. May 21st, 1998, Henry Sarton. Alrighty. So I guess that's the thing that was reach, uh, reaching up through the basement to attack us. Ooh. Someone appears to have vomited blood on some of the newspapers. Uh. Uh. Back. Back. Yeah, we're not dealing with you. I'm pretty sure I'll have to dip backtrack in here at some point. This... Oh, what's this? Wait, 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 what, what happened? Okay. And then can I push this this way? Yes, I can. And there's a trap, a ladder. I have a feeling that's going to take us down to the plant. Interesting. This is pretty industrial underneath the house. I guess this is close to the labs. Yeah, this is the aqua ring. Great, so that means that it's going to have freaking plant thing near it. Ah, wait, before I do that... Let's push it this way. Just quickly check and see if there's anything underneath it. Which it doesn't appear to have anything. And this is locked from the other side. Why are there so many pushable boxes? I get a feeling that uh, this is going to... Yep, that's what I thought. So we need this. To get across. That's one. Bum 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 bum. All right, can I get across here? Not quite. We still need that third box. I'm not necessarily keen on the fact that I can tell when something is usable. Like, I know that that, that, that kind of makes it easier for the player so they're not getting lost and confused, but it's almost too obvious that this box is movable as opposed to another box that kind of blends in with the background, if that, if that makes any sense. Um, but it's kind of like in, like, 
uh, old Scooby-Doo cartoons, you'd see all these rows of doors, and the one door that's a different color from everything, so you know that door is usable, or open, it's going to open at some point. Alrighty, I think we, uh, got progress there. Now, am I going to... Ooh! Uh, do I have room? No, I don't. We'll grab you later. Okay, I think this is where plant 42 is. No, it's not. Okay, so there's no items in here. What is that? <gasps> Sharks! Nope! Nope! <laughs> nope! Nope! Uh, let's quickly... Okay, that door's locked, so we have to go here. Oh my god. Okay, those are hurting a lot. Just need to run and hope it gets caught on geometry. Yep. I don't think we're going to be able to kill those with just a handgun. Oh my god. Oh my god, no. Yeah. Mmm, crap. Is there anything we can do here? I don't think we can do anything here, because that plant's right there, it's gonna kill us. So I think we're gonna try and make a run for the other door. I don't think the shark's gonna get us here. It's locked. The words power room written on the door. Of course, the only thing that would give us power to the rest of the area is locked. That's locked. That's locked. We haven't tried that door, though. So, let's try and make a run for the exit again, and hopefully we don't get murdered. Yes, thank you. I know the, uh, the really, you know, urgent music is telling me I need to run like a little bitch. <laughs> oh, son of a bitch! We're stuck here. Nope, going up, going up, going up, going up. Okay, and we're on the outer ring, so we can hopefully make it. Oh, crap, 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 crap! Yeah, Chris, we know, you're hurt. Oh, get fucked! I'm about to, if I don't fucking make it to that door in time. Yes! Okay... Yes, thank you, Green Herb. I know you are there, but I cannot pick you up. And I cannot access that. That door is locked, so I can't do shit all. There's a ladder here. I will climb up. And we're going to go back and store some stuff that we really don't... Actually, I could probably put... Oh, hold on a second. Let's do that. And we're going to go down and we're going to grab that green herb and we're going to use it. And then we're going to go fill up the shotgun and grab that. Because... 
those sharks need to die, at least one of them. Because I can avoid the other one a little more easily, but... Not being able to avoid both is kind of the issue here. And then of course there's that big one that just pops right up. Alright. So we'll check that other door on the way out too. And hopefully it has something that we can use in it, otherwise uh, I must be missing something. Okay, so the other door is in here. Thankfully that Zambie is dead. Alright. Where is it? Right at the front here. Please don't have anybody in here! What is that? Water drips from the sink, perhaps. The valve is... Yeah, that's great. What's in here? What is... Ooh! Sparkly! Water. Yes, 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 yes. What is this? The residence key. Yes, I will take the key. I think that'll get us into the other door that was locked. Do I have everything? Yes, I do. Alrighty. out here. That's lovely. I have a feeling that was because somebody was turning into a zombie, so he ended up vomiting all that blood out. Nope. Get fucked. It's locked. The door plate reads gallery. No, I am not- no, I do not wish to be stung by a bee. It's a pain in the ass already getting eaten by sharks. At least the bees are easier to avoid. Do we still have our crate here? We do. <laughs> oh, why? I thought we were safe. Wait, have I not been in this door yet? Oh no, yeah I have. Okay, well... I don't think we need this. And let's get rid of the canteen for the moment. And we have a first aid box, but it doesn't do anything for us, I don't think. I'm gonna double check. Yeah, it's useless. Why would I... Why do I have this? I don't understand. It must be something I'm supposed to combine stuff with, but I don't know quite what, so if you could let me know in the comments, I would really like to know. Uh, shotgun... Still got the little key. We're gonna keep the book. We're gonna keep the other key. Because I think these are all things that we def- Actually, you know what? I'm gonna, as much as it's telling me not to, I'm going to make another save here. Because I do not want to make a shite ton more progress and lose it all. Plus, we've got three ribbons, so we're definitely not hurting for them. And I have a feeling we'll find a couple more eventually, too. Alright. So we're going to try all the doors that we haven't checked yet. Which is, in fact, this one. Sweet. No further use for the key. Yes, I will discard it. Yeah, I think we went down the, the water, uh, the aqua ring a little too soon. What's in here? Hopefully, no zombies. I spoke too soon. But you're on the ground. Please stay that way. 
Oh, he's probably laying on that item that I'm looking for. Ugh. Full of dirty water. Yes, I will pull the plug. And it's probably gonna wake that guy up. Something inside the bathtub. The control room key! Did I get everything? Yep. Okay, bye. Bye! And he's probably gonna open the door. And I don't want that. I really don't. But... <gasps> oh! Self-defense gun? I won't take it just yet. And why? Because there's this. Sir, you're dead, right? Like, you're definitely dead. You're not coming back. I hope not. An old bookcase. The books are mostly con litter cluttered with... Littered. I apologize for that. Cluttered with literature and philosophy. Self-defense gun? I don't understand what I would need that for. But from the looks of things, that's the only other item in there. So... Let's... Quickly put... A couple things away, because I don't think we need that book right now. And I don't think we're going to need all the magnum ammo, so let's just quickly top up the gun. And pop this in here. And let's go grab the self-defense gun! Because, yeah, I think it's probably best to have it with us. Although I'm not quite sure what we would use it for. Again, still not sure. Yeah, I will take it. Oh, suicide note. Great. I had to do it. We ran from those things, helping each other to survive, but Robert started to show the symptoms. I had to do it. Those damn things are pure evil. There was no other way. He would have done the same if it were the other way around. After I put him out of his misery, I had to leave him in the bathroom. Now I'm probably the last one. How could this happen? I'll never forgive myself for being part of this project. Eventually, I'll get what's coming to me, though. There's no way to escape from this nut house. It's just a matter of time now. Everything is set. All I need is a little courage to get it done. Knowing that I'll leave many things undone is regret beyond words. But this is better than just waiting to turn into one of them. Please understand and at least let me end my life as a person. There's a message on the back. Linda, please forgive me. Yeah, you just stay there, please. Is there any other items? No. Okay, we're leaving and we're not coming back. That's really awful, though. It's like, yeah, it's like a really bad situation to get caught in. Can't blame anybody for wanting to take that out. Okay. We need the control room. We have a, yeah, we do have a slot. So I'm going to go and grab the shotgun ammo. Because I think that's the only way we're going to be able to deal with those sharks. Let's grab this. First aid box, that's great and all, but it doesn't really do anything for me. Ah. Oh, hold on. Nothing unusual. Nothing unusual. Insert first aid kit case. Oh! 
mix of green and blue. Okay, so I guess there, yeah, it's a small healing and, um, poison cure. Which, I'm a derp for not even checking the other case. We've had another healing item with us for so freaking long, and I've just been dumb. Nope. Not falling for that again. Okay. Sharky shoes. We're coming to deal with you. I've also got two flashbang grenades, which is nice. Keep running, Chris. Keep running, Chris. Into O2. Let's go and see if we can deal with these guys. Because there's no other way to go except down now. This game is so much fun. I just... I didn't think I would enjoy it as much as I am right now, but it's just... It is so much fun. It's locked from the other side, of course it is, because nothing's ever easy. I was hoping maybe the control room key would work for that too, but guess not, it's literally just that one area. Alright. We need to go... here. Running! Nope! Back off. Come on, Chris, you're almost there! You did it! You did it! No, I'm just gonna hold onto the key for no reason. <sighs> Alright, we're kinda hurting here. But it seems there's... The warming lamp indicates... Oh, warming. Warning lamp indicates there is an emergency. No shit! What was your first clue when I got attacked by sharks? Oh. Hi, sharkies. I'm in here and you're out there. And... Error message is displayed. Something appears to have gone wrong while the water was being drained. There's a switch to drain the water. Press it. Yes. <gasps> Emergency. Emergency. Unknown source of pressure detected. Locking all doors to achieve maximum safety. No! No, we don't want that! This is not the time! What? And oil pressure. There's no need to adjust the pressure. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. Reaching 30% of pressure threshold. Uh, what do I do? What do I do? Oh god, help me. What do I do? Oh, what's this? Uh, caution in case of a drop in oil pressure control. Open valve number two. Reaching 50% of pressure threshold. Activate emergency drainage system immediately. Suck it. What? Oh my god, are you kidding me? 70% of pressure threshold. Switch, uh... Number two. 
Oh my god! Reaching 90% of pressure threshold. Da 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 da! Pull it! Oh, thank God. Ah. Yes. Suck it, you sharks. Oh. Oh, my God. Yes, we're going to use this. That was intense. Jeebus. Raccoon herb. Green leaf vacuum packaging. A mixture of two green herbs. Sweet. I like that. Okay. Now that the water's drained, it's telling me there's still an item around here, which is probably the map. Guess I will take it. Okay. You got the map of the Aqua Ring! Achievement unlocked. Okay. Can I go out here? Yes, I can. Oh yeah, it just finished raining. Well, I think we're going to end it here today, so thanks for watching, guys. Uh, this has been Resident Evil HD Remaster. If you liked what you saw, please leave a comment in the comment section below. And remember to like and subscribe. It really helps me out a lot. So thanks for watching. Bye! Ah!